Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. I had the awesome opportunity to collaborate with Miss Barbie Baby. She has awesome videos. I'll leave the link to her channel down in the description box. We wanted to recreate this look that Kylie Jenner had on the Madden Girl ad. Um, she did the makeup look and I did the nail look. So please go check out her channel for the makeup look and enjoy this video on the nail look. Okay, I'm gonna start off by taking off this nail form from Harmony. I take off the little sticker, put it in the back, and I just um, give it that C curve, make sure I reinforce that. Now, when I'm gonna put the form on the nail, I'm gonna make sure that the line in the center of the nail form is aligned with the center of the nail. Once that's aligned, I just secure it on the bottom and on the top. Okay, I'm gonna start with Nova Inks Clear Acrylic. It's an awesome quality acrylic made in the USA. And I'm gonna start with one medium bead in the center of the nail, right where the form and the natural nail meet. I'm just gonna put it, and since the weather is a bit cold, I was having, um, that first bead, as you notice, it was a little too wet because, um, you know, when, when the weather is cold, it affects the acrylic. When it's cold, it dries very slow. So when it's cold, you just have to have less liquid on your brush so you don't have that problem. And as you saw, I added another bead on the top for the cuticle area, and now I'm adding a bead on the bottom and just brushing it um, towards the top. This is a almond shaped nail. As you can see, I'm forming that tip. And when I put it sideways, you can tell it needs some in the center to give it that strength. So I added another bead to the center of the nail, just brushing it to the top and uniting it with the rest of the nail. On the Kylie Jenner ad, the nails kind of curved down a little bit. I didn't do that. I just made it a regular almond shaped nail. And now I'm gonna pinch it with a pinching tool um, just to give it more strength and give it uh, that perfect shape that we want. Once it's dry, you remove the nail form always towards the bottom. And this is how the nail ended up. Now we're gonna file with a 100-100 grit file. Just always filing the sides and once you go to the bottom, that's when you make sure you have that point on there because we want that almond shape. Now I'm buffing the nail, making sure we leave it smooth and ready for polishing. After we buff it out really well, we take off that excess dust off, first with a little manicure brush, and then I spray some alcohol on it and just wipe it with my uh, lint-free wipes. And this is the result, clean nails ready for polish. I'm gonna prepare a little a dappen dish with some acetone and this little French brush that I have available in my online store and I'm gonna start with the striping brush using black polish just making these two little curved lines I'm sorry it gets a bit blurry here but this is the only part in the video where it gets blurry I apologize for that um, but as you can see I'm only filling out with a thicker regular polish brush after I do the lines with the striper I get the regular polish brush and just fill in the other lines. After I fill in, I'm just gonna clean that cuticle area with my French brush and acetone. About my online store, I did have it open for a week and it just closed this past Monday. Um, the reason I close it is because I want to catch up as it's it's only me by myself <laughs> doing all of this and with a new baby, sometimes on my, I'm on her schedule. So um, I wanted to catch up and send out those orders, make sure they all go out. They all went out and um, I'm going to reopen it this coming week. Um, in the next video that I upload, I'm going to give you the exact date. So just look out for that video and um, I'm going to upload it this weekend. Okay, as you can see, I just added Nova Inks UV Shine and put it in the lamp for two minutes. And this is the end result. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Go check out Miss Barbie Baby's um, makeup look. I'm gonna leave the link in my description box. Thank you so much for watching and remember, live to inspire.